सरदार वल्लभ भाई नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी सूरत गुजरात हैज रिसीव्ड एन ओवरऑल रेटिंग ऑफ फोर स्टार्स फ्रॉम स्टूडेंट्स ऑन शिक्षा डॉट कॉम हाउ आर द बी टेक कोर्सेज लेट्स फाइंड आउट इन दिस डिटेल्ड कॉलेज रिव्यू वीडियो स्टार्टिंग राइट ऑफ विद प्लेसमेंट विच हैज बीन रेटेड थ्री पॉइंट नाइन स्टार्स टोटल ऑफ फाइव हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी सेवन स्टूडेंट्स वर एक्सटेंडेड ऑफर्स फ्रॉम अ पूल ऑफ एट हंड्रेड एंड फाइव एलिजिबल कैंडिडेट इन द ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री ट्वेंटी फोर प्लेसमेंट ड्राइव सोफा द हाइस्ट सैलरी रीच Offered was 8.8 lakh per annum. A look at the year-on-year -year trend reveals a 38% growth in median packages in the last three years. A quick comparison with other neighboring state NITs reveals that SVNIT Surat needs to catch up with MNIT Jaipur and VNIT Nagpur. JPMC, Well Fargo, John Deere, and several others were part of the campus placement drive. The top roles offered included that of junior engineer, sales manager, project manager, back-end, and front-end developer. Speaking of internships, students begin receiving internship opportunities starting in their third year. A total of seven B.Tech specializations are offered. Meanwhile, the eligibility requires a minimum of seventy-five percent in ten plus two, along with qualifying scores in JEE mains. A quick look at the cutoffs reveals that while the competition for ECE, CHE, and CSE streams has eased in 2023 compared to 2022, there is higher competition in CE, ME, and EE streams. Coming to the cost of the program, the tuition fee varies as per parental income. For incomes above five lakh, the fees is five lakh. For incomes between one lakh and five lakh, the fees is one point seven lakh. And for incomes below one lakh, the fees is waived. Switching gears to infrastructure that has been rated four point two stars by students. As per students, the classrooms at SVNIT are large and spacious, with some newly designed for certain departments, while a few still retain the old design. There are separate buildings for different branches with well-equipped labs. The entire campus is Wi-Fi enabled with a central well-stocked library. There are three girls hostels and seven boys hostels on campus offering single and double sharing accommodations. Hostels are equipped with laundry facilities, 24 by 7 security surveillance and recreation rooms. The overall cleanliness of the rooms is commendable though the washrooms need improvement shared students. The mess food is average and completely vegetarian. A number of sports facilities along with the gymnasium are available for sports enthusiasts. Apart from these the college also Also has a health center clinic providing round the clock medical services. Speaking of faculty, students have given them a rating of 3.7 stars and shared that the teachers are helpful with most faculty members having completed their PhD. They have good experience and knowledge with commendable teaching quality. There is a mandatory 75% attendance criteria. The curriculum is relevant emphasizing practical application to ensure students are industry ready. The semester examinations are of moderate difficulty. There are mid semester and end semester examinations along with regular quizzes and tutorial tests. A research park known as Eshine has been established to foster and commercialize entrepreneurial activities both on and off SVNIT campus. Moving on to campus life with a 4.3 star rating. Over 20 student run clubs and societies host events round the year creating an action packed and vibrant non academic life. The annual cultural fest and tech fest are the most awaited events. Now finally the rankings were in 2023 the institute stands at 65th position slipping down 7 positions in just one year. For more details on SVNIT Surat and to check out thousands of course and college reviews visit shiksha.com. We'd like to hear from you so do drop in a comment below and do not forget to like and share this video.